What's up drivers? Welcome to 6 Minute Saturdays. I'm your host Dash Cam Hull. Let's see what's been happening in Hull this month. Editing Cam Hull here. So originally when I recorded this video I rambled about how nothing had happened in Hull except someone balancing a surfer on top of a Mondeo, which I was surprised the recent storms hadn't yeeted into someone's second floor window. And the day after recording this, a ton of people sent me the following footage. Get the fuck out my car! <laughs> now this all started when these two were stood in the middle of Anleby Road blocking a bus, before the chap in the grey tracksuit pressed the door open button on the outside of the bus, threw a liquid at the driver and allegedly spat at one or more of the passengers. Get the fuck out of my town. Being cheered on by onlookers also recording from the bus, Mobility Mike proves you don't need function of all four limbs to lay down a beating. <laughs> so as usual, as you can see, Hull is an increasingly pleasant place to live. Get the fuck out of my car! It's impossible to tell if the bloke just walks out which triggers the spooked reaction from either the learner themselves or the instructor, but his smirk and general demeanour definitely scream troll to me. Either that or he's hoping for some compo. It's also very easy for any of us to sit here and say, oh, I could have done better, Joe F should have slowed down more earlier. But his attention was probably on the cyclist. The pedestrian obviously spooked him too. Once again, it's time for me to preemptively apologise to a certain demographic of my audience as we take a look at some senior moments. Here's a classic hands up if you need lessons moment. There's a certain Liverpudlian would say. <laughs> Only someone who has lost their hearing through aging wouldn't be able to tell why Joe's horn behind them is so overwhelmingly loud. Your boots open. Your boots open. And while we can't actually tell, it's pretty safe to assume that anyone doing 33 in a 60 zone in a cash guy is most likely over 60. It's time for this month's donkeys. You f***ing donkey! Today's first donkey ward is a pretty viral clip at the moment, but if you haven't seen it, you'll probably be in as much shock as I was the first time I saw it. Fuck? Now you're probably thinking, okay, yeah, that's pretty bad, but this crash isn't why they're getting a donkey award. However, the second one is. Oh! Oh, shit. I've heavily debated whether or not to actually show this next clip, as they say in Rome, fuck it. I present to you a Chrysler 300 with fake Bentley badges being driven by someone having the most monstrous, universe-destroying mental episode you will ever witness. This situation goes from bad to awful to awe-stricken jaw dislocation for everyone watching. Her friend seems way too calm explaining what's happening as this is just her. Dude, you stop recording, dude. This is like some serious shit. Like, she has like some. Okay, dude, this is her. She has like, I don't know. Um. I think we're gonna need a bit more than that. She can get a donkey award too for being so utterly determined to have her limbs or chest crushed or be run over by her friend. And we'll give yet another donkey award to Denver Police, who only showed up once this lunatic was long gone. And from what I've read online about Denver Police, they'll most likely just tell every witness to fill in a report online that no one will ever look at. Plus, over three months on, it seems as if this driver was never tracked down and never caught. Uh, she left her friend! <laughs> 
I cannot find anything about the outcome of this clip other than that the driver pure got away with it. Anyway, it is time for The Road Rules. Yes, it does. Nice to see you. Yes, it is. <laughs> this is where we'll take a look at the best and more frequently the worst of the miscellaneous driving clips that I've stumbled upon during my internet browsing. With snowy weather suddenly hitting not too long ago, we once again got a wave of drivers who struggle to even drive during a light drizzle. Jesus! The best part of this clip, however, is what this guy says next. You want a rally career, you? Now, this being the internet, we all love a good cat clip. <laughs> and what's better than seeing a cat absolutely mug off an Audi driver? <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, in Scotland, just to absolutely solidify the yellow dollar sign for this video, here is apparently an attempted carjacking. Definitely an interesting tactic. How? Makes me wonder what the book is that that dude is holding. Carjacking for dummies? Probably spent his morning reading the how to put a driver in a titty trance section on page 72. If you don't do something, I call the police. Biking DC gets hit off of his bike while delivering a customer's food and drink order. He goes back to the restaurant to get replacement drinks for the customer, and when he delivers them, the customer had prepared a little first aid kit for him to take with him. Oh, did you seriously do that? Yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. That's some faith in humanity restoration that I think we really needed this month. Finally, if there was ever a video to convince you to buy a dash cam, it's this. A six-year-old girl sent flying. Don't worry, regardless of the chaos this month's Saturday video has been, I'm never going to show a child being struck. Father of the year comes running over to complete his priority list of one, ignore small child next to the road, two, punch driver's bonnet, three, yell at driver, and four, check on child's injuries. I could have done better. The neighbours of the father, both those who saw what happened and one who didn't witness anything at all, all piled on with their police reports against this poor driver, claiming that he was speeding, distracted and under the influence. And they were like, you are going on 80, you must have been drunk or something. How can you hit a girl? This video evidence really saved my life because if the police listened to the statements and I could have been charged guilty. If you're looking for a good quality dash cam, there's a bunch with some discount codes available in my description. But anyway, that's all we have time for today. If you like this video, Video, give it a like, please give me a sub, turn on notifications, and we'll have another chin wag really soon. Peace! Get the fuck out of my town! Get the fuck out of my town! Get the fuck out of my town! Get the fuck out of my town!